Over the past 50 years, the Holy Spirit has been creating a new way for church ministries. Since their arrival in Australia, religious and priests have established schools, hospitals and other social ministries. Throughout this time, lay people have helped as teachers, nurses, specialists and in other roles. There was a sense that the lay people were cooperating in the work of priests and religious. After the Second Vatican Council in the 1960s, lay people were increasingly welcomed into leadership roles, such as school principals and hospital administrators. The ultimate authority was still the bishop or the head of the religious congregation, but they saw these lay leaders as their co-responsible partners. More recently, the church has established a new type of body where lay people have replaced religious priests and bishops as the authority. These new bodies are often referred to as ministerial public juridic persons. While hardly any Catholics have heard the term public juridic person, it has been a feature of the church from early on. You see, the church is made up of persons, humans like you and me, but others are legal creations. Public juridic person, or PJP, is the name the church gives to a corporate body, a person created by church law. A PJP, like a company, can own property, it can employ people and enter into contracts. Within the Catholic Church, there are many PJPs. Parishes, dioceses and religious congregations are all PJPs. Since the early 1990s, PJPs have been established across the world for the specific purpose of being the church authority responsible for health, education and other ministries. It is because of their specific purpose that they are referred to as ministerial PJPs. There are 13 ministerial PJPs within Australia. Five ministerial PJPs have education ministries, mainly primary and secondary schools. Four have health, aged care, community services, family services. Four have a combination of education, health, aged care, community services, family services. God's creative spirit gave us ministerial PJPs. Their staff and the people they serve experience spirituality through the big questions of life. This is the only contact most of these people will ever have with the church. Their ministries bring Christ's love to about 4.4 million people each year. Ministerial PJPs continue to faithfully fulfil God's mission for the church.